So, as you guys can see right here, okay, we are going into three different secret bases, okay? And you guys can all see that this is the movie Luca, guys. This logo is pretty cool. If you guys didn't realize, this logo is actually drawn with, I guess you could say, a watery paintbrush. And this is some really, really cool colors. As you guys can see, we got the nice blue serene, very, very calm ocean Luca logo here. And we got our good friend over there, Luca. We got our good friend over there, also Alberto, who actually taught Luca how to walk. And actually taught him, you know, quite a lot of stuff. And then we got our good friend over there, Guila. I'm not even sure if that's how you say a name, okay? You know, I'm not good at pronouncing names. But today's video is going to be super interesting because each secret different base has something inside it that we don't know what it's going to be. So, with that being said, guys, I kind of want to see what's inside each one. And I am intrigued to see exactly what's inside each one. So, with that being said, do not forget to leave a like, do not forget to subscribe. It's been your boy, Drewsum C. And let's roll the intro to see what happens next. Don't forget to subscribe and keep notifications turned on to join the notification squad. So as you guys can see, we are here in this lovely, awesome, amazing world. Now, of course, okay, this is a pretty crazy world. Now, okay, guys, we need to actually look at what is inside each one because I don't know which one to go inside first, okay? We could do any mini, mini, mo, but that isn't really an effective method of choice, okay? So I'm not gonna go, okay, and usually we start from left to right because, of course, Luca is our favorite character and the sun is actually going down. So I'm gonna go ahead and make sure the sun comes up because if it's nighttime, we don't know will happen guys so let's make it date okay so as you guys can see right here we are now at daytime now of course i would go left to right as you know even when you're reading a book you go left to right but i'm gonna go from right to left guys because i haven't actually done a video with guila before so i'm thinking okay maybe i should do a video now i don't know if it's guila or gila okay so comment down below letting me know which one is it is it guila or gila guys i i, I honestly I, I honestly can't remember my memory is somewhat terrible so i don't think i'm gonna need any weapons at all i just think i'm gonna need a batch of tools which i already do have that are gonna help me complete whatever task it is i need to do so let's slap on the night vision goggles we don't have long on these goggles guys where are they oh they're here there we plop them on there we go and then all we got to do is press n slap them down there we go and let's open this place right here okay 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 what do we have here guys oh my god guys i have so many different questions i don't really actually have that many questions i kind of know what's going on i guess no in fact i do have a lot of questions because i don't know what's going on but what i oh wow all those bats are pretty creepy but as you guys can see right here we've got guila you know helping um luca read or something like that i'm pretty sure i don't even remember guys i watched a movie yesterday i'm gonna have to watch the movie again it's definitely one of my favorite movies guys as you guys can see oh my god this scene right here okay and i know i'm gonna get to do whatever this is but this scene okay can we just talk about this scene for a moment guys this was an amazing scene where they're eating pasta and she eats the pasta and then she hops to the bike and rides away it's an amazing scene guys leave a like okay comment down below let me know if you know that scene okay that pasta eating competition was pretty cool okay i i, I would like to in fact wait a minute guys wait a minute is that the reason there's all this food are we having a food competition here guys is that what we're doing Guila? is that what we're doing maybe we're doing that that would be pretty crazy i think that would be pretty awesome okay not gonna lie i think that would be pretty crazy if we are having a food eating contest i'm not sure guys so as you guys can see right here, um, Guila is also here as well, um, probably signing up to something, I'm guessing, or probably talking to someone, okay? I actually can't remember this scene from the movie, but let's talk about what we need to do in today's video. Guila actually looks pretty cool. So it says, mine blocks below to check, okay? If the food is Italian underneath, the sand it will say. So I'm guessing what we're doing, okay, is guessing whether or not this food is Italian. Now, not gonna lie, guys, I am not the most cultured person. I haven't traveled to many countries around the globe, but I do know my thing or two. Oh my god. We're going to run another night vision potion, guys. So let's go ahead and get another one before we run out and we head into darkness. You guys can see right there. We're about to head into darkness. Guys, you see, we're running out. We're running out. Okay, put on our new night vision goggles. Oh my god. Okay, you can must guess what food is Italian. Oh, wow. Okay, so I'm going to have to guess which food is Italian, which is fine by me. As you guys see, without these night vision goggles, boom, I can't really see much. So we got to keep those on, okay? We got to make sure we keep those night vision goggles on. So we got to see, okay, which... Visual, vi oh my so yeah, it's looking like, okay, that we need to be in a situation where we have to find out which food is Italian or not. Now, um, unfortunately, it doesn't look like there's any pasta here because, of course, we know that pasta is originated in Italy. It's pretty, it's a pretty big dish over there. Now, um, I'm guessing we've got, let's see, we've got one, two, three. In fact, we just count on one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. We've got like fifteen different pieces of food guys that's pretty insane if you ask me so many different pieces of food i'm getting super duper hungry guys my stomach is rumbling just looking at all this tasty food oh gosh 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 okay so first here we got a coffee cup okay now oh this is a tricky one okay because usually okay they actually call 
coffee cups, venti, okay? In Starbucks, they say venti, and they say that... Is it Italian or Spanish? I actually don't know. I think that's actually Spanish. So I'm going to say coffee is not, okay? I'm going to say that this is not. Now, burgers and fries, okay? I don't think this is Italian. Kuila, could you help me out here? Welcome to my kitchen. Well, thank you very much for, 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 for you know, having me in your kitchen. But I don't think this is, um... I don't think this is it, guys. I really just don't think this is. I'm not going to lie. Um, but let's see what's over here, as you guys can see. Um, we've got some... Are these donuts? Are these look like... What is this, guys? I'm not even sure what this is. It looks like some frosted donuts, okay? Um, I'm actually going to mine this and see what it is, guys. What is this? This is a sweet roll dish, okay? Wow. Never heard of this. Looks absolutely tasty. I may have some. Now, here, we have some bacon that is frying. Um, and I'm guessing that potentially this is not Italian, too. The only thing that I can think that is most likely Italian, guys, is this pizza right here now let me know what you guys think okay you guys can also see okay if we look behind this this is actually an upside down creeper face which i personally think is really cool but um yeah okay so i think this is gonna be um italian so i'm gonna you know leave this one i'm gonna dig this one in a minute um hot dogs no this is a chocolate cake with cream and cherries that is not italian um these look like this could be a uh, pasta in a bowl but i'm pretty sure it's noodles um, and some other stuff. So I'm guessing that's not Italian as well. Honey is pretty normal. We've got some chicken here, which is, oh, that's so tasty, guys. I love a bit of chicken. Oh my God. Okay. I'm just, it's just so crispy. Okay. And then we got cheesecake. Oh my God. I love cheesecake, guys. Or is that a cheese roll? I don't know. Either way, cheese, cheese is just brilliant. Okay. Just absolutely brilliant. Okay. Then we got bread, the staple. Then we got, I don't even know what that is. That looks like, like a Minecraft potion. And fruit hoops. Okay. Oh my God. Fruit hoops, guys. Don't even eat too much of this. Okay. It's, it's really addictive, but it's, it, it's got too much sugar. So I think the only thing, that we have that it's in Italian from Guila, guys, is this right here. So we're gonna mine this and hopefully we get this right. Because everything else, okay, we're gonna also mine it to see if we got it right as well. So I'm gonna mine this down. Um, and I guess it doesn't say anything right here. Oh, it says this is very Italian. Okay, so we got that right, guys. That is actually pretty cool. It's actually pretty nice, guys. So you guys can see here that we actually got this, which is Italian. I'm guessing no other food was Italian, guys. As far as I can see, um, I don't wanna mind the block she's standing on. But, uh, yeah, I don't think any other block was Italian, guys. So, Guila, you did a pretty good job. Okay, you did a pretty good job. But pizza was the only Italian thing that you had here. And, um, and, and I would take a slice with me, guys. I'd take a slice of hot and tasty pepperoni pizza. Um, yeah, that is pretty crazy, okay? Let me see. Uh, okay, uh, let me just open this up. So, Guila, um, ciao bello. I don't even know if that's what you say. Is that what you say when you meet them, ciao bello? Okay, let's let's um, go into this one, guys. Now, this is uh, the Lucas Secret Base, guys. Let's go over to here. Open up, open up, open up. Oh, my God. What is this, guys? This is the Alberto one, actually. So, let's take a look at what we got over here. Alberto. Oh, I forgot his last name, guys. I actually forgot his last name. Here with Alberto Scorfano, guys. And let's see. Oh, wait. No, this isn't Alberto Scorfano, guys. This is actually Luca Pagulo. Is it Luca Pagulo? It's Luca. Oh, let me just double check. Luca, Luca Pagulo, guys. That is his name. Look at the night vision, guys. This one is actually pretty not badly lit, but the night vision always helps. So Luca Pagulo, um, as you guys can see, Luca Pagulo, pretty cool. Oh, Luca and Alberto Scarfano, pretty cool dudes. Okay, so it says, there's a secret chest in here somewhere. You must find it. You don't have long. Okay, this is pretty bad. Okay, so Luca is over here, swimming away, doing what he wants to do. Okay, he actually does look like a pretty pretty evil sea monster, but I know he's not an actual sea monster. He's a pretty cute little dude. You know, he's a pretty cool dude, okay? So, um, yeah, let me see what we have in this place, guys. I'm not even sure what we have here. Let's see. Um, I'm guessing that what we have, guys, is a secret chest. Well, it says secret chest, but these chests aren't secret, guys. So I'm guessing, okay, you know what we got on our hands here? We got ourselves a decoy chest, guys. Just trust me. These chests, okay, a decoy chest. Luca, you're a pretty smart guy, but you're not smart enough for Jerusalem Z, okay? I can guarantee you that. So these chests, okay, a decoy chest, meaning that there's likely nothing in these chests, guys. These chests are here to prevent me finding the real one. Now, I have to make sure that this isn't a double decoy, meaning that, you know, these decoys aren't the decoys, okay? But there's a chest somewhere nearby. I'm just wondering. Should I break the glass? In fact, let's do it. Let's break the glass. Let's put on our night vision goggles. Let's break the glass. Is there a chest up here? No. Down here, there could be. I think there could be. No. Okay. Uh, underneath here. Oh, this would be a, an amazing spot for a chest. Wow. Nothing. Okay. Uh, where's the next glowstone? Over here? Nothing? Oh, wow. Okay. Down here? Oh, nothing. Okay. Luca, you've, you've, you've out... Whoa. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let me jump in. Let oh, I don't even have a block. I don't even have a block, guys. Can I make a glowstone block from this? Oh, there we go. Brilliant. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Okay. So let's break a block there. Break this. 
break this. Don't worry, Luca. I'm just stepping in to see your secret chest over here. Guys, did you see this? Because I saw this, okay? And I gotta realize I gotta hold my breath, okay? So, guys, up three. Luca, you ready for this? Hopefully, you found it. Well, I just did. Three, two, one. <gasps> okay. Oh, my God. There's so many diamonds there. I gotta even take them all. <sighs> okay. That was pretty crazy. Luca. Okay, I'm gonna leave you to swim around in your little enclosure, but I'm not gonna lie, okay, that was actually pretty neat, okay, pretty neat from you, you guys can see that right there, he actually did a pretty swell job of making me believe that there was a decoy chest, okay, not gonna lie, Luca, you did a pretty good job, Luca and a bottle of two crafty, crafty people, but, you know, I'm guessing these guys do have a lot of items on themselves, because, you know, um, in the movie, Luca was actually collecting quite a lot of stuff, okay, now, with these diamonds, of course I'm gonna return them, guys, I'm not a thief, I'm not stealing diamonds from my good buddy Luca, and wow, it's night time, so, Let's continue on. So I'm guessing that that one was supposed to be Alberto, but we just witnessed Luca. Are we going to see Luca again or are we going to see the return of Alberto Scarfano, guys? I'm not sure if we're going to see Luca Pagodo, but let's see what we have here, guys. Oh, wow. We've got so much more characters, guys. So many more characters. And what do we actually have to do here? Because I'm a little bit confused. So do you mind explaining? Okay, name all the characters. Oh my god, we have to name all of these characters. Okay, this is pretty hard, but if you're a hardcore Luca fan, okay, you're gonna be able to do this relatively easily, guys. Now, me, I watched the movie yesterday. Um, oh, in fact, not yesterday, I watched it a couple days ago, guys. Um, and yeah, of course, I know I should be able to do it. Okay, so this guy right here, okay, is a pretty much of a. Yeah, you know, we don't like this guy right here, okay? So this guy, his name is Eric Cole, uh, but I don't remember the last name, guys. Do you guys remember the last name? His name was Eric Cole. Uh, Eric Cole, this, Vince Scott, what is it? It's, it's Eric Cole, Vi I don't even remember the last name, guys. It's Eric Cole Visconti, I think, I think. Eric Cole Visconti, I think that's his last name. Uh, this guy right here, okay. Oh, this guy is a big buff dude. Uh, this guy is the one that hunts sea monsters, okay. Uh, what is his name, guys? Oh, can I destroy this? Oh, my God, I just placed aside the wrong place. Okay, let's place this out right here. Uh, his name, I think it starts with an M. It's like, but Minissimo? Masibo? Mas I think it's Masibo, guys. I'm pretty sure it's Masibo. Okay, uh, there we go. Masibo. Then here... Oh, this guy. I think I saw Lorenzo, guys. It's, it's Lorenzo Paguro. That's that, that's Luca's dad. Lorenzo Paguro, guys. I'm very, very confident on that one, guys. Okay, and this one is... Is this mother or grandma Paguro? I don't remember. I think this one is... Is it? I don't remember, guys. Who is it? Is she the mother or is she the grandma, guys? I think she is probably uh i don't know i actually don't know guys this is one where i am confused no is this a grandma no this is the grandma because the mother is green grandma paguro guys oh my gosh how could i the mother is green guys oh my gosh guys my memory is failing me and then then we got these two guys i hate these two guys okay i don't really hate them i just don't like them that much uh then we got cco and guido guys okay two uh you know th th these guys are basically his little minions okay so yeah, as you guys can see, um, all of them in the movie. That's correct. I've got all of them in the movie, as you guys can see. And yeah, look at that, guys. That's crazy. So we got um, Eric Cole, Massimo, Lorenzo Paguro, Grandma Paguro, and Cicido and Guido, guys. Two guys that we don't ever want to see again. So, guys, if you enjoyed today's video, I'll be seeing you tomorrow.